What's up guys, my name is Poké Facts and Plays, and today we are here with some really big news uh, that's going to be really important. Now, a couple weeks ago I made a video about shifting, and people commented how it was really ridiculous and stupid and how they didn't like it, and everyone was saying how they wanted to be banned. And now, finally, on September 1st, and all expanded tournaments in the future, for the rest of this year at least, Shift Tree from 72 from Next Destinies will be banned. Now, Shift Tree had the ability, let me see if I can zoom in. Um, when you play from your hand to evolve, you may flip a coin, and if heads, you choose one of your opponent's Pokemon, and you shuffle it back into your deck. Now, with things like the Evolution Spray Recycle, this thing is broken. So let's just read the article and see why it was banned specifically. So they say, as of September 1st, Shift will be banned from all sanctioned play Pokemon tournaments that use the expanded format. The card has created an undesirable play environment because it creates a strategy that frequently wins on the first turn of the game. And by frequently, they mean about 75% of the um, time or more. And so people were playing counters, making decks specifically to beat Shift Creed. Now, even with that, you can still play things like Latios and Mew to counter it. And another thing is, it creates a non-interactive envi play environment where your opponent has little impact on the outcome of the match. Sure, your opponent can try to play down as many Pokemon if they go first, and then they can try to do something, but other than that, they're screwed. So, there's just so many bad things about the card. The And then they, they can go, and, go on to say Dot from Flashfire and Nuzleaf from uh, also from Flashfire or Gla Grass, but they will not be banned. Nothing else will be banned, just Shifty specifically. Um, which is kind of unfortunate, because if you want to make a kind of rogue deck, uh, another idea to, to, of banning Shifter and nerfing it would be to uh, nerf a force of giant plants to only evolve into grass Pokemon. But uh, I guess this is the option they have they have decided. Um, but yeah, they go on to say that if you use a uh, force of giant plants with the evolution spray, with recycle, with super scoop up, with super screw up cyclone, with a bunch of other things, you can just it's ridiculous. Um, so they go on to say, I also say, uh, the giant plan strategy works consistently enough to cause concern. Frequent, frequent turn one wins are a sign of unhealthy play environment, and the shift deck is capable of doing that a high percent of the, percentage of the time. Like I said, like what, around 80% of the time. Since shift has a clearly negative effect on the expanded format, we feel the best option is to ban it for that environment. Um, it does, re they say it does rely on, on um, coin flips. But with things like Shaman and Bicycle, they can just go through it. And they, they also do say Wildfat and Baltoid do counter the strategy. But you, you can get around it with using Lysander or other things like Mew and, and Latios. And this is like the most important thing that's in the, the last section. Currently, the expanded format contains over 15 Pokemon TCG expansions. As new expansions are released, powerful card combinations with other cards may arise. Therefore, we will aggressively monitor let me, let me just read this out loud to you guys. Aggressively monitor tournament results and new expansions for any unhealthy card combinations. If any cards have a, have a negative or centralizing effect on the metagame, we will ban them to maintain a fun and healthy play environment. So this is super important. This last this last paragraph is extremely heavy. Um, because Pokemon does not have a ban list, and they have rotation in the set. It's, they're going to have to be doing things like this to balance the game sometimes. So if they see any like stupid broken combination, they will continue to ban cards. Now, I don't want this to become like Yu-Gi-Oh! But, I, want, but I, want, I think it's good that they see a problem with, with cards and they're like, okay, we got to fix this. So make sure to write down your comments below. I want to get a healthy discussion going. Do uh, you guys think it should have been banned? Personally, I, I, I really think it did. Because um, if it didn't, there would have been three decks at regionals, or or uh, the kind of three decks. So there would have been uh, Baltoy with Wawafet, or Baltoy combinations with like Vesper Queen, or Wawafet Gengar, or Wawafet Trevenant. There would have been Shiftry, and there also would have been maybe things with Archeops. And then there might have been some other rogue decks that I don't know of. But because of this, the format would have been like so bad and like gross that it. It wouldn't have been like it wouldn't have been real Pokemon, because this is what remember um I don't know if you guys remember but in 2009 there was a deck called Sable Donk, and that got banned immediately 
Actually, I didn't get banned. I didn't, nothing got banned in that deck. Um, actually, there was a mid-season rotation, which is r ridiculous, just to prevent this from happening. Now, a deck that I will be covering tomorrow is actually a really interesting, another Donk deck from this. So you guys have, will have to be, stay tuned. I'll leave a link in the description when it comes out. But, um, yeah. So thank you guys so much for watching. Leave what you guys think below. And, uh, what do you guys think about this? Bye.